Dave, welcome to Bristol Bears, the start of a new challenge for yourself in the coaching career. What about, what about Bristol Bears appeal to you? Um, obviously, firstly, the vision of the club, um, to be sort of a Bears family, to bring the men's, women's, um, youth academy games together, um, and to represent the city of Bristol, which I grew up in, was obviously massively appealing um, to sort of work, you know, under a guy like Pat Lamb, in terms of his vision for the club, um, but also, and most importantly, is to work with the players, the, 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 uh, the girl players at Bristol Bears, because you know there's some fantastic talents there, some really you know good players who are probably some of the best in the world, and for me to be able to work with them was a huge draw. Performances in recent seasons haven't been to the desired level. What do you see as key in turning fortunes around on the pitch? Um, unfortunately, I'm going to give you a boring answer. It's pretty much fundamentals. I mean, I have to go back to basics in terms of what, what our structures are. Um, playing the Bristol way, discovering how the Bristol way is um, for us girls, definitely. Um, and then understanding how that's going to affect the rest of the league as well and, and working really hard. You know, and the girls, I'm sure, will uh, be pleased to know that we're going to work really hard in pre-season um, and get you know, the, the new season off to the right start. This season will also see a closer partnership forged between the men and women's programme, which is only going to benefit Bristol Bears women, isn't it? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. I've, I've spoken to a couple of the guys already, actually, in the, in the men's squad, who are keen to sort of offer their expertise, and maybe a little bit of mentor, mentoring ship, is that a word? Being, <laughs> being a mentor for the ladies. Um, so they're looking to, you know, bridge those gaps even more. And like I said, be it a one club vision, and we've seen how successful the men can be, it'll be a massive feat if the women can come close to that. The Allianz Premier 15 is a very competitive league. The club and yourself have stated the ambitions of competing towards the top end. How are you going to go and do? How are you going to go about that? It's going to be a big challenge. You've already got the likes of Saracens, um, Harlequins, Was and Loughborough that have nailed down those top four spots for the last three seasons. To get amongst that, I mean, Exeter gave it a good go this season. They've won seven in a row. The only team to do that this season, and that they're fresh to the league. Um, for us at Bristol, it's kind of sort of focused on ourselves in pre-season work out what everyone else is doing um, when the league starts and then go for it. It's an 18 game sprint, you know, that's, that's, you slip up once or twice um, and you'll miss those playoff places. Um, but for us, definitely, we're just looking pre-season, get that under our belt, get everyone on the same page and then look from there.